Uh, Psalms 18 verse 2 tells us, The Lord is my rock and my fortress, my deliverer, my God, my strength, in whom I will trust, my buckler, the horn of my salvation, and my high tower. I'll say it again. The Lord is my rock, my fortress, my deliverer, my God, my strength, in whom I will trust, my buckler, the horn of my salvation, and my high tower. Psalms 18.2 this, this scripture is telling us that the Lord is everything to us. Why are we so afraid to call on him? Why are we so afraid to give ourselves to him? You call on everything else. You call on everybody else. Put the phone down. Stop calling on people. Quiet those voices. Sometimes when you have things going on, you have so many other outside voices and so many other outside um, influences. And you're not calling on God. Let him help you. He wants to help you. He's telling us. He is our rock. He is our fortress. He is our deliverer. He, it tells us right here. He delivers us. From anything that we are facing people are in pain people are suffering even in the midst of the smiling and happy faces glory to God for joy but in the midst of having joy comes pain Nobody's going to have a good day every day. Nobody's not going to have a good day every day. And sometimes we go through things in our spirit that other people can't help you with. And so, God is telling you, He is the deliverer. He is the rock. He is the fortress. He wants us to call on Him. He is such a loving God that He is waiting for us to call on him and to share our problems with him, to share our feelings with him, to be open and honest and transparent with him, to rely on him, to trust in him. We have to learn that he's here waiting for us. We have to learn that we are his children and he is our father. And he wants us to come to him with all of our needs, with all of our wants, with all of our fears, with all of our everything. If you think that you are alone or you feel alone, yeah, we feel like that sometimes. And yeah, sometimes it can be hard to call on something that you cannot see. But that doesn't mean he's not here. That doesn't mean he's not working. That doesn't mean he's not covering us. That doesn't mean he, he, he does not care about you and is waiting for you to come closer to him so that he can come closer to you. God is so real. So, 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 so real. But he's only as real in our lives as we allow him to be. Let him show up and show out for you. Let him show you just how real he really is. Just because things don't go our way all the time does not mean that our God is not real. And that he is not here to love on us and to give us everything that he promised us. Give him a chance.